NBA sports, and man, the energy around this city and here inside the arena is electric as they get set to kick off a homestand. Both teams are lined up, and we are set to get things going. The Wild have established possession here early in this one as they win the draw. And that was read perfectly. What a play by Carlson. And that's knocked away by Prosser. Grabs it in his own end. Quick feed to Champion. Moves the puck along the half wall. Tried to get 2 Q with it and loses possession. Champion's trying to get a little too fancy with the puck there, and as a result, he loses it. Michael's got the puck in his own zone. Quick shot with the stop. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Lots of time left in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Minnesota's won the draw and they'll go to work. Oh, and gives up the body as he lays out for the block. What a selfless play. Sent into the offensive zone. Quick pass to Enroth. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Big save in front. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space. Goaltender does it, makes a save. Jahan's been showing some frustration. You know, when you want to contribute as an athlete, especially when you have a strong skill set, and then you're in a pointless streak, man, the frustration grows and it builds, and you start to squeeze the tech tight. The Jets will play oh. for the defensive zone. Sorry, James, didn't mean to step on your toes, but that was a massive hit, and now the play continues. Moves it quickly over to Kane. And he takes the pass. And uses the length of a stick to knock that puck away. Appleton's got it in the defensive end. He carries the puck up along the wing. Minnesota's got the puck. Here we go, on man rush. Tries to get it to Velarde. Taken by Ehlers. Here's a short pass to Velarde. Shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Well, he makes an incredible save on a point-blank shot here, James. I love the way he's aggressive, he's competitive, and he wins the battle. Off the outside of the iron, and we'll play on. I know I stepped on your toes there, James, but had to react to that massive hit. Moves it to the middle, and he denies that great opportunity there. Moves it to Perry. There's another stop. And he scores. Lee gets all of this one, James. It explodes off of his stick. He just labels it over the glove of the goaltender. Winnipeg's got to be feeling good about their game tonight. Here they already lead in this one, and they've been dictating the pace of play also. Well, they get the game's first goal midway through the period, James, but I liked their game right from puck drop. I mean, the way that they started, the urgency around the puck, they pounded it, they had a heavy forecheck, and now they get rewarded for their efforts. Good use of the body on the play. Coughs up possession of the puck. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. Oh, he got hit by a freight train there. What a collision. Penalty coming up here. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take a penalty and play shorthanded, James. you got to find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. For this group here and we know their penalty kills rank toward the bottom of the league but this group's got a lot of confidence a lot of energy they just might be able to shut down this power play unit gets a hold of the puck they'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty fires it turns it aside with the glove well we know he's got a great glove hand and man does he ever show it off right there with that stop Collins ready for the draws they will continue to try to kill off this penalty And off the draw, they'll take possession. The Wild have the puck against the boards. 
Handles the pass. Carlson's got it along the wing. Puts it on net. Oh, what a stop with the pad by Dubnik. Quick feed to Carlson. Trying to get it down the ice. He grabs the puck here at the point. Quick pass to Ehlers. Minnesota's got the puck shorthanded. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Musa quickly over to Connor. Here's a shot. Comes up with the glove save. Boy Boost out there on this shift, guys, and he's looking to spark this team. If he can use his own ability to generate scoring chances, he could really influence this game. Off the try, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Here he is in close. Oh, he gets his glove on that and just enough to keep it out. Dubnik's able to get to position and negate that dangerous lock shot. And that's offside, stopping the play. Well, Lardy's had the face-off dot ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Swoops in and grabs the puck with the centers tied up in the scrum on the draw. And the puck clears the zone. They'll be forced to leave as well. Winnipeg's got the puck in their own end. The Wilds have taken over in the neutral zone. Pass across to Stahl. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Shot! And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Barron's been feeling it, James. He got the go ahead goal, and now the puck's on his stick. Dubnik's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. Niederreiter's known for having great control when switching to the backhand, which is quite difficult to do. And that's why we call it his beauty backhand zone ability, guys. He just loves scoring that way. Winnipeg's got it, and they're on the attack. And he takes the feed. Grabbed along the board by Niederreiter. Winnipeg's got control of it now here in the offensive end. I'm not trying to take your job, James, but I have to mention that big hit. Wow, that was a ringer. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Perfetti's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Comes up with the stop. That was like a great technique and the athletic ability to backstop his team effectively. Silverberg's got that 1T zone ability, which is his powerful one-timer shot. I'm excited to see these players compete and give their team the edge. Now back to you. More than half the frame has been played here. The Jets lead it 1-0. Winnipeg's got a hold of the puck. Slides the pass over to Barron. Moves it around along the half wall. And that's a great heads up in the defensive zone to force the turnover. Minnesota's been working hard away from the puck, and they're using their awareness to take away angles and seams. And this is something they're doing with their stick positioning. Coach talked about it pregame, how important it was going to be. Winnipeg's got it in their own zone. Here's a chance. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Dubnik. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Collins won the draw here in the defensive zone. Minnesota's in on the offensive attack now. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. The Jets will play it in their own end. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Back to the point it goes. The rookie, he's hunting down his first goal. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck now. Now a quick pass to Niederreiter. And a strong physical collision on the play there. Here's a short pass to Perfetti. Uses the force on that hit. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Oh, 
ahead, 1-0. Koivu's won a big draw on their own end. And it's a quick pass to Silverberg. And he takes the feed. And he takes the dish. Moves the puck down low. Picks up the puck. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Up along the wing. Oh, look at this chance! Moves it to Prosser. A big time save! Oh my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. Pokes it away in his own end. And he loses control of the puck. Hellebuck's last save was absolutely incredible, James. Not only was it pure desperation and athleticism, but I'm not sure how he can stretch that far. I think he's been doing gymnastics in his off time. And now he moves it to champion. Good heads-up defensive play as he extends the stick. The Jets looking against the half wall. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. Minnesota's got the puck after winning the defensive zone face-off. First 20 minutes of play is in the box. Both teams get a chance to refresh and reset. We'll be back with second period action in no time. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment. Well, James, this has been a really fast game. It's got a ton of pace, but the goaltenders have been excellent in this one. Back and forth action, making a number of saves. you got to expect that it's going to blow open soon if this continues. I'm surprised it's only 1-0. Makes a move in front. Oh, gets a pat on that one. What a stop by Hillebuck. A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. Lots of time left in this period. Winnipeg's up one set. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Oh, what a stop by Hillebuck. Rebound control is critical in the game of hockey. Putting it to the corner and now the offensive player has to pound the puck. Quick feed to Michael. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. They are really feeling it now here in the Ozone. Silverberg. Shot! And the puck skips off the glove. And he slides it quickly to Ehlers. Gives him a jolt with that hit. Koivu's moving the puck through his own zone. Takes a shot. Passes over to Barron. Oh, he got all of that against the boards. No room for that one to get through. Barron. Broken up by Suter. Quick pass over to Stahl. And lowers the boom with a big time hit. Wow, this is a message sending hit, isn't it? When you get all of your opponent and you're able to separate the body from puck, you know you've done your job. Message delivered. And there's the save. And he slides it quickly to Samberg. Takes the feed. Kane's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Scandella. Scores! And the scratching and clawing has paid off as we are back to even. Well, back to even, James. I really like their game. I mean, when you're pushing and you're trying to find a way to get ahead and on top, you have to trust the process. That's exactly what they've done, and they've been rewarded. 
for it. Man, James, he's the benefactor of a great passing play. I mean, incredible vision to be able to land that puck right on his stick. But then he's got to do something with it, right? He's got to read where the goaltender is, and he's got to hit the back of the net. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Stalls won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Quick pass to Pominville. Hunts the boards through the neutral zone. What a hit on the play! Stalls! The goal, goal, puts them in front. And now they're in front, James, and they'll have some energy. You know that their first three strikes will be more urgent, but they'll have to be accountable on the other side of the puck as well. This play does not happen without that beautiful pass, James. It's all about reading where the coverage is and knowing exactly how your teammate can skate onto that puck. And when you skate onto it, you have some speed. You can get that shot off the way you want, and he capitalizes perfectly. The Wilds have a little breathing room now, up by one in the second. Yeah, and it's a real important time right now, James. They've got the go-ahead goal. Now it's about having the killer instincts. Play in attack mode, stay aggressive. There's a lot of runway left, but if you can get another, you can really sink your opponent. Minnesota's got the puck against the boards. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Dumps the puck in. Minnesota's got possession of the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. That's blocked. Scores! That's three in a row! Oh, so much easier when you're running in the game and your opponent is chasing, and that's exactly what's happening right now. for it. Here's a short pass to Johns. Here's a shot. And he comes up with a glove save. Champions playing with such confidence right now and he's got this point streak going and when that's happening for you, you're having a ton of fun putting up the points. Minnesota's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. Oh! Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Takes the pass. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Moves it to champion. Minnesota's got it along the wall. Enters the offensive zone from the left. And some smart heads up defensive play by Prosser. Here they come on the attack. Denies him! The goaltender's at the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. Hammers one! Comes up with a big time glove save. I'm not sure how he saw this puck, James. I mean, he's screen. There's a ton of traffic, and he finds the puck to make the save. That one's a fabulous one. Hellebuck's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. Past the halfway mark of this period, Minnesota's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Collins won the draw here, and they'll go on the attack. Long jab in front. That's broken up. Gains the zone from the right side. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Slides the puck to Scandella. Picked up along the wall by Koivu. From the left side, they gain the zone. Knocked away. Rips it along the wall. Denies him. He got all of it. Quick feed to Ehlers. There's another hit. And you get a sense that this was a game plan to go after him tonight here, Cheryl. Well, he certainly has a bullseye or a target on his back, James. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the faceoff. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Koivu's going to play it against the half wall. A 
chance in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. He scores! Four straight goals that are rolling now. And talk about confidence, hey, James? I mean, their opponent does not have an answer. They look absolutely stunned. I mean, they are like a freight train just pounding down on him. Man, he's got such amazing hands here, James, and he's known for it, but he's almost looking at their feet, knowing which way their toes are turning, and he's going the other way. Just beautiful play here to be able to create this goal. The Wild haven't looked this sharp offensively in a while, Cheryl. This is really impressive. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun to watch. I'm sure it's a lot of fun for them as well. They're showing a lot of patience with the puck, and when they're patient, their feet are continually moving. They're not static, and because of that, they're creating lots of opportunities to take it to the net. Minnesota's got a hold of it along the wall. Picked up along the boards by Stahl. Oh, thunder clap and knocks him off the puck. Handles the puck at the point. Here he is with the backhander. And a great read to turn that play aside. And this squad has really put the pressure on now. And it's picked up by the D. Minnesota's got the puck along the boards. Stahl's moving it ahead. Takes the knock, but he's still got the puck. Winnipeg's got the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Connor. Takes the shot, and that's broken up. Pommenville's crossed the line and is on the attack now. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. I just had a gander at the bench and the energy and the body language. I mean, they're defeated, James, and now they have to kill off another penalty down a bunch of goals. It's a tough one. Man advantage takes to the ice. It's our first opportunity to get a glance at the special teams unit. Well, they've earned their first power play of the game. A tone setter right here and an opportunity to look at the coverage on the setup. Oh, they do it again! You can certainly tell that the goaltender is dialed in on that last sequence of saves, James. He's to position, so he finds a way to make multiple saves back-to-back. -back. Power play continues with this offensive zone draw. Well, yeah, they have a numbers advantage, and they also have the advantage that the goaltender is extremely fatigued. They've got to drive the net, James. Receives the pass. Winnipeg's in transition. Puts it in deep. Quick pass to Burns. Looks to get the puck over to Stahl. There's the whistle, we get a face off after the goalie covers up. Kuparis recognizing they're still short-handed here as they get ready for the face off. Off the draw, they take possession. And a successful clearing attempt. Drives it to the crease! Turned aside with the glove by Dubnik. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Michaels won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Pommenville's got it across the line. Sends it out in front! Can't connect on the play! Tremendous stop by Hillebuck. Solid hit on the play. Oh, wow! Devastating hit there. Oh, painful, James. I felt that one in the broadcast booth. Handles the pass from the right side. Drives to the paint. Now a quick pass to Gostaspair. And that's deflected off someone in front. A chance to get it out of the defensive zone. Scooped up along the wall by Pominville. Good hit to pump him off the puck. 60 seconds left in this one. 56 seconds. All sorts of pressure here in the offensive end. They are really applying the squeeze. Look at this pass the clinic they've got going. And here's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on for a much-needed stoppage. They'll be looking to keep that momentum going here in the face-off. After that last shift change where they really press, they want to continue right there, get pucks to the net, because this goaltender will not want to battle net front. He's outworked already. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And they get the puck out. Time of the essence here. Yeah, they can't skate it. They got to move it to be able to gain entry quickly. 
Capo Bianco is almost out of the box. And it's a quick pass to Johns. With a comfortable lead, James, some would say that that power play really wasn't a big deal, but I would say different. It's really important that you push, you continue to work on your habits because the timing could be different next time. Fires it on net! There's the horn bringing period number two to an end. 40 minutes down, 20 to go. Third period action is coming up. Opening face off for period number three is ready to go. 20 minutes to go here in regulation, what has been a very one sided affair. Well, with two periods played, Pounder, your thoughts? Winnipeg's got to get the puck, James. I mean, to put it in layman's term, one, you got to get the puck, two, you got to score. They're not doing either. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Champion. Here's a chance in front! Puts it off the post! And that's intercepted by Niederreiter. Oh, he hammered him on the play! Oh, this is just a thunderous hit. Talk about physical engagement. He got all of them, James. <laughs> that was big time. Power forwards are often heavy on their skates. They're strong, they're physical, and they know how to retrieve Fox. And man, can they deliver bone-crushing hits. Minnesota's been a dominant force offensively. Plenty of quality scoring opportunities, and they lead it big time early in the third. Passes it over to Ehlers. Handles the puck. That goes off a twig. Takes it along the wall by Appleton. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Well, the shooter's going to run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. Bullardi's taking the puck now here oh. inside his own territory. Works it across to Ehlers. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. Here's a short pass to Silverberg. Regroups with the puck back inside the D zone. He says, let's get physical on that play. Quick shot, makes the save. Scrum along the boards, they battle for the puck. Grabbed along the boards by Stahl. Winnipeg's got the puck in the defensive end. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Penalty coming up. Center into the middle. And pucks in the net, but the whistle sounds blowing the play down. Now you're down a bunch of goals here, James, and really you take the penalty because you're chasing the game and you want to get back into a hit, but this one, this one's a tough one to take. Minnesota's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. You know they haven't scored on the power play yet. 100% is not a number that you see typically. So they've got to find a way to just stay confident, trust the process, and their skill sets. Oh, what a pass saved by Hellebuck. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Kupari's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Minnesota's won the draw, and they'll go to work. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Puck cleared from the defensive end. And that's off a stick. And that's poked away by Kukari. They go on the attack from the left side. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. And that one's denied. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. The Jets win it in the defensive zone. Blows them up on that hit. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck. Can't keep a hold of it. Drills them. Power forwards drive lanes and they drive bodies, and that one's perfectly executed. Speed 
through center, and here they come on the attack. And that one's turned aside. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Back here to the They score! for a goaltender to get a read on James. You're in that inner slot area. The puck's on the backhand, fighting for position and getting it off quickly. That's a tough one to read and a reason why it goes to the back of the net. Minnesota's added yet another one here to the total tonight. I mean, what a performance. Yeah, they've had the puck on their stick for a majority of this game. You know the coaching staff is going to be impressed. Hey, maybe they'll get the day off tomorrow. And off the face-off, they take possession. Stanley's got it against the boards. Minnesota's looking to break out of their own end. Across the line from center. Sends the pass down low. Oh, what a violent collision there. He just got railroaded. Close space so fast and just taken down. Heidola's stick handling in his own zone. Moves it up through the middle from the right. Takes the puck at the point. Great reach with the poke check by Koivu. Moves it to Stanley. Over the line they come. Here's a pass to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. The Jets had a terrible effort tonight, and you know that practice tomorrow is going to be a tough one, and the video room is not going to be pleasant. Picked off by Appleton. it over to Cullen. Slides it to Burns. Niederreiter's got it through the neutral zone. Levels him with the hit. Winnipeg's got the puck along the wall. Minnesota's ready to go on the attack. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Gets the puck over to Niederreiter. Sorry for stepping on your toes, James, but that was a huge hit behind the play. Played big in the moment there. Here we go. They're dropping the gloves. You knew this was going to come after they hit their star player. Well, and if you're going to touch the star players, you're going to have to answer the call. They certainly don't want their top players in a fight. So here they come, the enforcer. comes to an end with the takedown. I think he might be relieved as they head to the ice as he was taking the thrashing. <laughs> I think you're right. Sometimes when you're getting blown out and you're upset and you're frustrated, you're sending a message to your team as well. You're sending a message like, hey, we got to finish this one strong. we got to send a message for the next time we meet. Well, it looks like the officials have got all the debris off the ice and we're back to getting some hockey going again. Michaels won the draw and they're on the attack. Great defensive effort with the strip. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. Oh, that's a good hit. Here's a shot, and he makes a save there. Dubnik's been solid here tonight, James. I mean, look at his save percentage. He's been excellent between the threes, and that's making the saves that you need to and you want to at the appropriate moment. Man, his team's been effective going north. Minnesota's dominated in the puck possession department, putting plenty of shots on net, and they lead by a wide gap in the third. Picked up along the wall by Burns. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Takes a bump, but hangs on. Oh, and comes up with a stop. Puck is frozen, and we'll get a face-off. The Golden Knights are up next on the schedule here on this homestand, and you know, I'll tell you what, you talk about traveling fan bases, they have one of them, so if there's tickets still out there, you better jump on them before it's filled by a rival opponent. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Ains the zone along the right wall. Shot! Oh, good night on the play! Wow! Oh, a true competitor save just when you think that he's completely out of it, James. He comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Let's get our third number 
the broadcast team back in here, our own Carla Fade. What you got going on? Silverberg's at the edge in our matchup tonight, guys. He may not have any points, but he stayed with it and played hard for sure. Quick feed to Barron. Tosses it to Chase on. Quick pass to Barron. The Wild have the puck in their own zone. And that clangs off the iron. From the right side, they gain the zone. Silverberg's carrying it ahead. Winnipeg's got control of it now from their own end. Minnesota's grabbed a hold of the puck. Takes it to the front. Stopped by the goaltender. Now this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you got to be fast, you got to be quick and show those reflexes, he does that and makes the save. Peter Rogers' earlier injury is going to keep him out of the game, James. He just received confirmation from the staff, and this isn't good. Not good at all. Uh, huge blow for the team. And, and somebody who's just so well liked too, right? Those intangibles that he brings on the bench as well at times like this. Yeah. Don't like seeing that at all. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Slides the puck over. Stanley's not going to be able to get away from the Blues and the chance every time he touches the puck, all because of that play earlier where he hurt their player. Coming to the slot, scores! And they get another one here. Well, and the one positive is it's in their opponent's net, not theirs. I mean, they've been defensively brutal throughout this game, and it's a mountain to climb now. It's a massive hurdle here, James, but I guess that's the starting point. The Jets don't really have time on their side here, but at least they've got something to push with. Yeah, really tough hole to climb out of, but certainly that one goal will give them a little bit of a lift. It's respectable. Stalls won the draw. Slides the puck over to Pominville. Quick shot! That's not going to fool him. Loses his balance on the play. Battle along the boards. Moves it quickly over to Heatley. And he lowers the boom there. And that goes off course off a body. Oh, he caught him! Uh, that's a thunderous hit along the boards. It's bone crushing, James. You feel that one right from your toes all the way up to your shoulders. Talk about finishing a check. And the fans on their feet recognizing a solid victory here in front of them. And that's somehow stayed out of the net. Big save just as time runs out.